GBP USD. The previous week has made a breakout to the downside and everything was pointing that the price could go even more down after making a breakout outside of this indecision range area. Then the previous week has returned the price above and reached 1.2606 and there was, we can see that the price was trying to move to the up and we can see on a Tuesday the price reversed back down. So this was some kind of a small trigger with, uh, with a high price level with this week on this candle and the price has made uh, a, li a little bit bigger candle body that has overcompensated these previous four candles. And the price continued to fall down but the price could not make a close below this one which is 1.24. 254 price level and then the price returned back up around this supply zone 1.26 on the weekly time frame we can see that the previous week has made a bullish pin bar right here on the support level and it is also some kind of a small indecision candle which is uh, first of all is suggesting that the price could go down and we can see this week the price has gone a little bit down closing below the previous week open price and we can see that the price had weeks going up and down which means there is some kind of indecision between the sellers and the buyers at this current level on the monthly time frame nothing has changed too much because we had a weekly time weekly time frame candle uh, very close with the open price and close price which means on the monthly time frame this this didn't change too much from the previous week analysis I have mentioned that the very important levels is this one here 1 1.255 and this still stays as it is in the previous week. Nothing has changed on the monthly time frame because we have two more weeks until this month ends. So it depends how this month will close but currently what I have said in the previous week analysis this is suggesting that we could see the price on the lower levels. So this is also uh, the same prediction for the next week and for the next two weeks I have currently on this currency pair. If something changes I will see that on the daily analysis. On the weekly we can see that very important levels this one here 1 1.254 and if the price goes below that this will trigger a sell off to going down even to 1.245 price level. So it will be very important to see how this will go on the daily time frames. On the upper side if the price goes above this is the first level that the price needs to make a breakout to see the price on higher price levels and that is 1.267. If the price closes above this will mean that the price could reach this level here around this one where the, these weeks has reached and that is around 1.278 so these are very important levels but as it looks right now the price is making uh, making a lower candles body closing each week lower and lower even if it is small so this is some kind of uh, information that the sellers are much stronger and at this current moment on the daily time frame we have seen that the price has made breakout to the downside and did not make could not make a movement continuing reaching here an area around 1.2 to 1.245 which is the low, lower side currently below these price levels and it is the next demand zone a support level for the price the price has tried to make return back inside this range area but could not succeed that and we can see these candles especially on the friday we can see that the price was trying to reach higher price levels but could not close above this one which is 1.262 so currently what i can see i'm still open to see the price on the lower side and i'm expecting that the price could drop even more down based on the monthly and also a weekly analysis but based on the daily analysis i can see there is a fight between the buyers and the sellers who are fighting to reach lower side now for the sellers i'm expecting to see 1.255 being broken to the downside which will trigger that the price could reach this area around this one 1.245 but if the price goes above 1.262 and closes the day above this will mean that the price has returned back inside this range area and it could bounce between these two price levels until that happens i'm still open to see the price on the lower side because the price is currently below this supply zone and we can see this is the sellers who are not uh, allowing the price to go above to 1.262 and reaching higher price levels for now 
if there is some kind of a breakout to the upper side above 1.262 or below this one 1.255 i will make the daily analysis and i will share with you inside the telegram group the link will be below in the description so if the price makes a breakout to the upper side or the downside I will also uh, make the analysis with the potential target where the price could go. But have in mind that each, each time when the price makes a breakout to the upper side or the downside, it needs to be validated with the next day candle, just like in this case where the price has made a breakout to the downside, but outside of this area and with the next candle that has been formed down, which means this bearish breakout has been validated and it was expected that the price could go down. But we will see, the price is still active and it is below this supply zone, very important level 1.262 and it is on the lower side of this supply zone, which means there is still potential that the sellers who are here located, it will push the price down. This is all for today. See you next time and happy trading. That is all from today's analysis. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any question, feel free to leave a comment. If you like the analysis, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and a happy trading.